Hey, what's up guys? Eskazoo here and welcome to episode 18 of Skill Into Glory. Yes, I know it's been a little while since the last episode, but we're finally back again. And in this episode, we're actually going to be making a brand new squad around the new 5-star skiller, which is going to be Fido Martinez, because in the previous episode, we actually unlocked Gary Mackay Steven. So these are the challenges. The first one is score 7 goals with Fido Martinez. The second one is score 7 skill goals. The third one is score a hat-trick with Fido Martinez. The fourth one is score a long shot. The fifth one is score 3 volleys. And the sixth and final one is win seven games so uh, those are all the challenges now we move on to the squad and I decide to go with this team 4-3-3 and then the second variation in goal we have a uh, second in form trap 84 rate right? looks pretty good alongside them we do have uh, two Brazilian center backs in Miranda an amazing center back I think and also second in form Thiago Silva really really awesome and strong duo uh, on the right back we have uh, Al Sharani the amazing cheap right back from the Saudi league left back we have a four star skiller in Zuniga the uh, transferred version, I think. Uh, CDM, we have Allen, a pretty solid-looking CDM. Um, alongside him on the midfield, we have Cardona, the informed version with four-star skin. was last year in the team this season, which looked amazing, but this year's pace went down a lot for some reason. Uh, then we have Carlos Eduardo, four-star skin was five-star weak with an amazing long shot. Uh, right wing, you have Aldo Sari, the five-star skiller we managed to get in a pack. Then uh, the striker, we do have Papon with four-star skin was as well, 88 pace. And then the left winger, it is the player which it is all about. That is, of course, Fidel Martinez and and this guy was actually amazing for me in FIFA 14. But ever since, he kind of dropped down stats-wise. He's still a 71 rated. I think last year he was one of the lowest rated 5-star skillers, funny enough. But um, he still looks okay, I think. Decent pace, decent dribbling. Not really the greatest shot, but hopefully he can, uh, he can score some awesome goals for us. Because that is, of course, our aim. But um, yeah, if you're interested in the squad, then there will be a link in the description down below, as always. So you can check out the price and stuff. And these are the two kits we're going to be using from the second league in Spain from Alba kate or something i'm not really too sure how it is pronounced I really really like the kids so i decided to go with them anyway we're going to the first game come up against a hybrid side some players from uh, the primera division in argentina the Serie A, and also the premier league and uh, we do get to start off with aldo sari a cheeky penalty who actually uh, beat the defender really nicely and we cut in there with a nice shot unfortunately this defender just got in away and blocked it off then uh, we picked up a corner and once again we pick it up with Aldo Sarri. Played on through to Pabon. A nice fake shot to go through. We go for a shot and a good, good save from his goalkeeper. So once again we do pick up another corner. It was a lot of pressure for us in the first like 15 minutes or something in the game. We got a big chance here with Fido Martinez. A good block. Then we get another shot in which the goalkeeper saved once again. And that is how it kind of went the first half. We created quite a few chances. And in the 45th minute we managed to break through with Pabon. At first he kind of brought us goalkeeper. So I thought I would maybe get past him. But unfortunately he kind of stopped running. So I just went with the finesse shot and uh, we do make it 1-0 a lovely finish and uh, we take the lead in this game In the second half we start straight from kickoff here with Fidel Martinez with some nice skill moves Of course I want to get uh, the first goal with him as well in this game since uh, we were actually really really close in, uh, in the first half with him um, Once again we pick up another corner a uh, nice cross there from Aldo Sarri where we do pick it up with Carlos Eduardo on the edge of the box Go with the volley the goalkeeper saves that we get another volley in where we do hit the post and I think it was offside at the same time as well Then in the 64th minute I make a huge mistake with my defender Thiago Silva the thing was that when I got that touch I just wanted to pass it straight away but because the ball went really really high I completely messed that one up and he literally just converted his first chance of the game into a goal and it was level again so pretty frustrating but it was just completely my own fault and since we were playing pretty good I thought you know what it's not going to be like that big of a deal because we can easily get back into the game that's what I thought anyway but in the remaining minutes in the second half the game kind of turned upside down a little bit he created a couple more chances even though I did uh, sub on Paul Pogba and a couple other players which are pretty good I I didn't really play as good as I actually did previously in the, in the second half and also in the first half he did get a big chance here though with Aldo Sarri unfortunately went over the crossbar then in the 90th minute my opponent got a big big chance to actually uh, give himself the winning goal here hits the crossbar and from the rebound he just missed out on the header and that is basically how the 90 minutes ended so we had to go into extra time even though I thought I could have maybe finished off this game in the 90 minutes anyway we start things off with Aldo Sarri on the right hand side so lovely skill was trying to go for a shot again a good save there from his goalkeeper and we pick up a corner in the 95th minute where we do win the header with Thiago Silva we sort of win it again with uh, Pabon we flick it up there with Fido Martinez and we go with a drop kick weak foot volley and we smash it into the back of the net we pick up his first goal for the team and we also sort of get the first volley goal I think it is sort of a 
volley more looked like a drop kick but it is still volley in my opinion so I'm gonna count it anyway then uh, straight off the kickoff we managed to get another chance with Pabon tried to go for a long shot since it was also a challenge unfortunately that one went over the bar and uh, that is basically how the game ended so well uh, we got the first win as you can see from the stats as well we probably could have scored a lot more goals unfortunately we uh, we only won it in uh, extra time but still we uh, we walked away with the win which I was happy with so uh, yeah we move on it will be the second and final game of the episode and we come against a Turkish league side with two five star skillers we got Nani and also Kwa Resma and uh, it was actually uh, us actually getting things started off here with Fido Martinez played on through to Pabon um, I tried to go with the ball world drag back there completely failed that one then we uh, flicked it up for a rainbow flick tried to go for a volley and failed that one as well not really the greatest start to this game then uh, we're in the 13th minute. This Allen on the ball plays it on through to Aldo Sari. Tried to get the early goal in the game. Unfortunately, again, it went wide. Then at 37th minute, Aldo Sari on the ball again. This time with some skill moves. And we get tackled inside the box, apparently. At first, at my thoughts. But then uh, I watched the replay and I knew it was inside the box. So uh, we step off right foot. Fido Martinez. And we do pick up his second goal in total. Making it 1-0 in this game. Then uh, we move it into the second half. And as you can see, my opponent also decided to pull off some skill moves. Kind of put me off guard there when I tried to defend him with Al Sharani. Then uh, I tried to push him over the line right there. But he managed to hold on. I sort of tried to tackle him off the ball again. It got deflected by Al Sharani. And he managed to tap it in with Karesma at the near post making it 1-1 so uh, just like in the previous game uh, after we took the lead in the game it is all level again so just tried my best to uh, pretty much get back into the lead again uh, we got a chance here with the Aldo Sarri with some nice game moves we got in with the McGeady spin we do get a shot in which I think got deflected as well but an easy save for his goalkeeper then a uh, 64th minute again uh, we got the ball here with Cardona some nice stuff there we go with a fake shot to a blank hop obviously trying to get another volley goal but a pretty, pretty bad attempt. Not really the greatest shot. Then uh, we pretty much had to go into extra time again. And look at that first strike from Robin Van Persie. Pretty much the first shot he had in extra time. And he managed to uh, bang it in basically. Really, really nice goal. Then a couple of minutes after it, he got himself another big chance with Van Persie. Which I just managed to clear off the line. So he got really, really lucky that it actually didn't, uh, didn't go in. Because it would have been the 3-1 and probably game over. Second half of extra time. We kind of got some chances as well. Also a ball got cleared off the line. By his defender from a corner, but uh, towards the end of the game, he managed to get himself another chance from a free kick from Jutsak, which my goalkeeper saves, and that is basically how the game ended. So, uh, unfortunately, we end up losing the second game of the episode. Real big shame, but um, yeah, that is what happens, of course. You can't really win every single game. Anyway, we're going to move on to, uh, to the skillers up, where you can actually see we have scored two goals so far with Fido Martinez in two games. Hopefully, we can kind of keep that up and obviously get a hat trick with him as soon as possible as well, since that is also a challenge. But anyway, guys, it's going to be the end of this video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then make sure to leave a like would be very much appreciated so i'd like to thank you very much for watching and i will see you guys later bye bye